Loki has a ball. Coach Paul Barrett says the goal of the Liverpool Football Academy in Indonesia is to develop the best young Indonesian athletes to play at the highest level of international competition. Obviously the dream for me as a coach and for the rest of the team would be to find that one player from Indonesia to go to England and play in the Liverpool first team. That should not be too difficult in the fourth most populous country in the world where football is wildly popular. But Indonesia has not done well in international competitions and has not qualified for the World Cup since 1938. The Indonesian government supports a mix of public and private initiatives to improve sports training programs. Indonesian Minister of Sports Andy Malarangan says after the upcoming Southeast Asia Games, the government plans to convert the newly constructed stadiums into regional sports training complexes. So, for example, in uh, Palembang, after the event of SEA Games, there's going to be set up a new sports school in the Jakabaring complex. So the, so the facilities are not going to be idle. Oh! <laughs> the Liverpool Football Club in Indonesia has set up a for-profit training and conditioning program in Jakarta and plans to open nine more facilities across the country. While students must pay nearly $100 per month, Liverpool plans to establish a free youth league to attract the best players in the country. Coach Yaya Uswaro, who used to coach at the professional level in Indonesia, says at the academy there is much more emphasis on learning the fundamentals at an early age than most Indonesians are used to. First education in football, like the very basic one, athletic ability, movement, coordination, passing and receiving and so on, they don't do it properly, they don't repeat it again and again. Many of the students, like Kir Darmanji, would prefer to spend time playing rather than working on skills like ball control. Oh god, that's probably ball control. I don't really enjoy that. It's like you just gotta tap the ball, it's really boring. But Darmanji says he is a better player for it. 14-year-old Reva Irshadi says he feels lucky to play for a former Liverpool player like coach Paul Barrett. I'm very proud that I can meet someone like my coach Paul. He once played in like the Liverpool and I think he played also one more game and he scored a fantastic goal. While the Liverpool name can inspire, the coaches say years of practice and development are needed to get the next generation of Indonesian players ready to play football with the best in the world. Brian Padden, VOA News, Jakarta.